Are you interested in learning how a tool like ChatGPT can boost your productivity, increase your salary, and make you a better cybersecurity professional? If the answer to all these questions is yes, make sure to watch this video till the end to learn how you can use ChatGPT just like I do. Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is Sohel and I'm a cybersecurity engineer and consultant. In this video, I'm going to exactly show you how you can use an AI tool like ChatGPT in your IT or cybersecurity career. Before we continue, just a reminder here. As you already know, AI tools like ChatGPT are not that smart enough yet. They cannot replace humans. So you have to make sure that you always review the suggestions and take its answers with a grain of caution. There will be time when you can easily challenge the AI tool and it won't always give you the right answer. So number one, one of the best ways I use ChatGPT is when I'm learning a new concept concept. For instance, while I'm watching a training on something that I don't know, let's say for instance, right now I'm learning about Terraform, how to use automation tool like Terraform in cybersecurity operations. While I'm watching a video training, there are things that I don't understand. That is when I'm going to use AI tool like ChatGPT to give me a different perspective on that topic. I'm going to use prompts like explain this concept in this training like I'm a five years old and it gives me the answers that I need. On top of that, you can use ChatGPT for researching purposes. The thing is, uh, when you're looking for something and when you hear something from somewhere or anywhere, let's say in a meetup or an event, and you don't know anything about that topic that these guys are talking about in that event, can actually easily use your mobile phone, use ChatGPT application and ask about that topic and content in ChatGPT and it will give you the answer in just a matter of a few minutes. So make sure to use ChatGPT or any other AI tools in your learning journey. The second way I use AI tools is for optimizing my CV when I'm applying for contract or permanent roles. This saves me a lot of time during job hunting phase. I start with the base CV and the template that I have and use prompts in ChatGPT to optimize the summary and the skill section of my CV according to the job description. I will post the prompts that I use in my job hunting phase in the comment section so make sure to go through and use those prompts in your job hunting phase. The third way I use AI tool is when I'm actually preparing for the job interview itself. The thing is, you cannot be 100% prepared for an interview. There are so many things that could go wrong in your interviewing process. But the least that you can do is to make sure that you are prepared well enough for that job interview. Me personally, I use ChatGPT like a mock interviewing kind of thing. I asked ChatGPT uh, to do a mock interview with me based on the job description and the name of the position that I've applied for. So for instance, you can actually copy and paste the job description into ChatGPT and ask it to give you all the technical questions or behavioral questions that could be asked from you in that job interview. The thing is, when it comes to job interviews, you need to make sure that you are 100% prepare all right another scenario is during incident response and troubleshooting sessions for example i was working with a team on a project a while back where we had to upgrade a nas network attached storage device to use the latest available encryption systems after we did the upgrade unfortunately there were some scanners that couldn't authenticate and send the images into the storage device for us to resolve that i had to attend a meeting do a troubleshooting session with the customer when it comes to these cases i usually use wireshark for troubleshooting to capture the traffic and see what's going on inside the packet. Unfortunately, I forgot a specific filter that I could use in Wireshark to get the answer that I wanted. The good thing was, ChatGPT was there to help me and rescue me in that situation. All I had to do was to give ChatGPT some ideas about my problems, what I'm looking for, so it can provide me with the right filter so I can use it in that troubleshooting session. I did that and I was able to resolve the issue ASAP really quickly, all thanks to ChatGPT. Lastly, I use ChatGPT for report writing and documentation in cybersecurity. As you guys know, English is not my first language and ChatGPT significantly helps me to enhance my reports and writing skills. So make sure to use ChatGPT in your documentation process or when you're writing a report. However, one thing that I want to mention here guys, to make sure not 
use any sensitive or classified information with these AI tools. This is not according to the best practices. You are not allowed to disclose any sensitive information with a third party tools like ChatGPT. Imagine this, ChatGPT may get hacked and all the information that is inside their system will be leaked to the internet. So go figure. All right guys, these were five ways I use AI tools as a cybersecurity professional on a daily basis. One thing that I want to tell you guys before the end of this video is don't be afraid to use AI. It can significantly boost your productivity, enhance your skills and your knowledge in cybersecurity industry. And don't worry about AI. It's not going to replace your jobs anytime soon. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button and make sure to subscribe to my channel. On top of that, don't forget to share this video with your peers. See you in the next video.